this chunk of maple burl. Thought I would cut off a piece to use as the base for our bone shaker hot wheel. And we've got to do a little cleanup here. And I'll tell you, this took a while. I like my Hot Wheel cars. Finding a place to mount the Hot Wheel on the piece of burl and getting ready to paint it as well. Had to do a little cleanup first just so the paint wouldn't collect any dust. Here I'm using some jet black uh, acrylic paint to paint the surface first. Now it's all painted black and I'm going to get ready here and put some fluorescent yellow on here just to cover the tips of the pearl cap. Now that it's all painted, I'm going to mount it right here on that piece of burl using this UV cured resin, UV curing resin. So there's the ultraviolet light, and you see that stuff looks pretty good. I put some on each wheel. And here I'm getting prepped to mix up the resin using um, uh, part A and part B. This particular resin was a one-to-one -one by volume mixture. Now pouring in the B side or the hardener side of this resin and mixing the two in the larger container using the drill paddle to mix it up thoroughly. And as you can see here I had to uh, modify my mold wasn't going to be quite big enough to hold the resin that I needed to put in here to cover the entire thing. And now going to collect the piece from the pressure pot. And what these pressure pots do is they uh, put so much pressure on the resin where the air bubbles had formed during mixing and it diminishes the air bubbles down to a level that you can't see them. All right, getting down to the fun part. And as you can see, I am mounting the piece on the lathe and uh, getting ready to turn it. You can also notice in that poured resin in that casting, there's a little piece of pine uh, at the base. I used some old resin to hold that in there, uh, so it would be kind of a sacrificial block.
Here I sanded from 120 grit up to 400 grit dry, then from 400 grit up to 1200 grit wet sanding. Then I used the complete set of the micro mesh pads. And those things, as always, did a great job. Well guys, here it is. The old Hot Wheels Bone Shaker Cast in Resin. I didn't show the process of making the little stand for it, but the little stand's made out of some uh, sassafras I had left. And uh, anyway, what you think? What do you think about that? Leave me a comment down there below if you think this is pretty cool. Anyway, I want to thank you so much for watching and sticking with me to the very end of this video. And I uh, hope you like the Hot Wheels. Both my wife and I are big Hot Wheels collectors. We have several. But uh, anyway, uh, I'll put up some stills at the end with the old beauty shots. And uh, until next time, see you later.